How's it going guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Bill. This is Matt. This is the Tat Squatch and this is not where we're normally at. Today we are out in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. We are at the uh, Bronco Stampede, the first annual Bronco Stampede. It was a pretty good turnout. I'll go ahead and insert some video here of us walking around. From that we're going to go ahead and do a quick install out here in the driveway of the mountains to metal uh, medicine cabinet that goes right back here it should be a really quick and simple install uh, we're going to find out for sure just how easy it is and while he's unboxing that let's see if I can't <laughs> pull this off I always want to pull it off from the further inside because the forward clips go under of course we may or may not have broken one of them previously but yeah this side clips out and then it pulls out and then if you've never seen in here this is what the inside looks like normally it doesn't have the sound deadening uh, that is something that was added but without the sound deadening is what this normally looks like <laughs> and then the medicine cabinet looks just like that. Pop it open, open it up. Keys. Ah, keys. Probably a good thing to have for anything that locks. A gasket. A gasket, and that's it. And what, two screws? Two screws and nuts. Two or three. And that's it. Alright, so. There's three screws that are on there. Went ahead, take you gotta take those out. And you're gonna take this piece out, and we're gonna mount it like so. But before we do that, we gotta put the seal on here. And it's just a rubber gasket. We're gonna pull off back of it and just kind of work our way around and get that stuck on there. Try not to stick it to itself. Matt likes to live dangerously, so just pulled the backing off the whole thing and going for it. And then it's just uh, two screws and lock wash or lock nuts that they provide. And then I believe it was 10 millimeter is the duct size on the back. There's some room where you can move this bar up and down and it looks like there's a little bit of room to line the bolts up. 
but that looks because that can even come down a little bit it looks pretty pretty good yeah I think right there is perfect so and that's just sitting at the bottom of these cutouts right yeah and that seems to be where it wants to sit to line everything up perfectly all right so now that the brackets on it's tight that's nice and sturdy that just slides on and I'll put uh, gotta go in just a little bit and then they just get tightened down all right guys so we installed this medicine cabinet uh, in the parking lot while we were out there and we thought it was a little weird that everything was right on this side and you can see how you can flex that side and after we shut the camera down we're like oh you know what we could probably just put some metal a piece of metal behind there and tighten that up and we could think, make something to work behind that make that work so it's pulling this side tight we we're both kind of scratching our heads though it's like why why did they not fix that and i was like they even have the bolts right there it's super easy we can make something to make that work turns out we don't need to there's a piece of metal behind there that we were supposed to take off and clamp back behind just got to take those two screws out so uh we'll take these three screws off pull this back out and then show you what we're talking about there in our defense it was too hot to think that day yes so yeah the metal plate we were thinking we were going to need to engineer and make to make that work it, the mountains of metal already figured that out so we just got to loosen these up and then that'll just slide over this should we take this oh never mind got it so now that should just slide over here first and then the back side will plop in so now that slides in position you can snug that up a little bit. We'll wait till we get those other screws in before we tighten it completely. But that tightens that side. So it turns out Mountains to Metal did think of it and we're just idiots. Yep, that gets. <laughs> And that for sure gets rid of any uh, movement or, yeah, that's not going anywhere now. <laughs> so it turns out they did think of it. We just didn't install it correctly. So now that that's installed correctly, I like it even that much better. So kudos to Mountain Cement Metal for actually doing that the correct way. We didn't have to engineer anything they would already done it correctly for us we just had to do it the right way and now we got now matt's got this safe in the back he could put documents or water guns or whatever he wants to put in there so you happy with your water pew pews yes water pew pews so are you happy with your medicine cabinet absolutely i was happy before now even even more yeah now it's definitely not going anywhere not going to rattle or anything so very sturdy so uh, i think that's going to go ahead and wrap it up for this video i hope you did if you enjoyed it if you did hit that thumbs up button if you'd like to see more videos like this in the future hit the subscribe button and be sure to check out matt over at tat underscore squat tat underscore squash and tattoo matt 71 on instagram there you go and we'll see you next time <laughs>